Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to start off by going to gmail.com and we're going to log in. So we type in our username and our password and we sign in. Okay, and then what you're going to see here is uh, settings up here at the top. Click settings. Okay, and now on settings, I want you to go over to chat right here. Okay, now um, look down here. We want to do voice and video chat. We want to verify your settings. So click that. Okay, and then you should come up here. See me? Hey, how's it going? All right, so now go down and you look over here and you can see. Can you see yourself in the video to the right? Yes. When I talk, does this microphone thing go up? Yes. So if, when you're talking, first of all, if you can't see yourself, you need to switch the camera here. And this is, you just click this and it's going to give you the options of whatever cameras you have on your system. Um, if you have the webcam plug in, plugged in and it doesn't come up, we'll have to work on that separately. But hopefully it will see it and you'll be able to select it. Uh, the microphone, um, you can select what microphone you want if it detects a few different microphones. Um, hopefully it will also detect uh, the uh, default devi device um, and if you have that set up in Windows to be the microphone on your webcam then you should just use default device. Um, otherwise hopefully you'll be able to see the name of your webcam manufacturer somewhere on here and you'll be able to click that. Okay, speakers. Uh, you want to be able to hear, obviously, what's going on here. So you can check either built-in output, um, which would be the speakers um, on your audio card, uh, or if you plug in a headphone, your headphone jack, um, then that would be coming out of there. So be sure that when you talk, you can see this little thing move here. That's good. And then when you play the test sound, you can hear it, which I can. So we're good. All right, so let's, um, uh, I would definitely check this box here to enable echo cancellation and report quality statistics to help improve Gmail voice video and chat. Why not? I mean, it'll help out in the long run and it's a great thing. So you may as well click that. Okay, cool. So, um, you know, all the rest of these down here is, you know, just preferences that you can set up on your own. And then you just hit save changes and uh, I don't have that option right now because uh, everything that I've done has already been saved. I haven't actually changed anything and so we're good to go. Alright, so that's how you set up your Gmail video settings.